Hi YouTube, Patrick D here again. We are back for another fragrance review. One of my favorite house, Tom Ford. And this is the Tom Ford Noir Extreme. But I know guys, some of you don't like unboxing review, but please stay tuned for our unboxing and presentation. Tom Ford Noir Extreme unboxing and presentations. This is the box, a very beautiful gold box. Your product name of the fragrance, Tom Ford Noir and Extreme Woody Parfum and 3.4 ounces. On the right, the F logo. On the left, the T logo. In your back, some of your ingredients. Your top, the TF logo. And your bottom is barcode and a box code let's open this this is your very beautiful bottle your bottle is a silhouette black your font name of the house and name of your fragrance comfort noir extreme in your um your the right is this this robe and engraved F logo. And the other side, the left side is the T. Your bottom 3.4 inches. Comfort Noir Extreme Udi Farpoom Concentration. And this is your cup. Your cup is gold. And on top of the cup, the TF logo, same with the box. And your cup, as always. It doesn't click to its place. Please, guys, do not pick this on your cup. And your atomizer is gold. Let's check this atomizer. I don't like the atomizer. Very narrow and yeah. Not great atomizer. That is your Comport Noir Extreme unboxing and presentation welcome back yes i like that a very classic you know a straightforward presentation so that's an eight out of ten presentation guys let's jump into the scent straight away to the juice we all just know the juice what about the performance versatility and the price guys i give this scent just a 7 out of 10. Yes, it's just very long lasting, but the scent, guys, is not for everybody. You know, someone off to them because of that dessert coffee. So, for me, I like it, not love. So, I categorize my fragrance, guys. I have almost 200 bottles. I categorize my fragrance as love, like, and hate. So, I like this fragrance. Just a 7 out of 10, in my own opinion. Um, yeah, let's break down the notes. The top notes are orange, neroli, saffron, nutmeg, and cardamom. Middle notes, lentils, rose, jasmine, orange blossoms, coffee desserts. Base notes are the woody notes, amber, sandalwood, and vanilla. Yeah, it's Tom Ford, guys. So, of course, they said, well, it's Tom Ford. It should be the best or nice. Now, for me, guys, just a 7 out of 10. As I said, I love, like, and hate a fragrance. So, this categorize in my, my like department. So, 7 out of 10 for this scent. It's just an... For me, it's not a mere wow factor because a gourmand is not for everybody, you know. Gourmand, like those dark, mysterious gourmand or sweet, just for me, it's just a 7 out of 10. 
and the versatility guys another 7 out of 10 because I could not see any young teens wearing this and I could just um simply say it's just a dress up um occasion but and it is a winter and fall fragrance so versatility is not really a dumb rich fragrance it is you are in that mood because it's a gourmand you know that coffee dessert is like sometimes is a very potent in the dry down so guys the versatility this is only a uh, dress up and adults and when do you wear this so winter and fall but you can rock this guys on a daily scent like an office you know the environment of dress up office and you can rock this in your church yeah I still a good church and they say it's a good date night scent I could just say yeah it's a, another good date night scent but my, if in my own opinion I have to be in the mood to wear this yeah the 7 out of 10 versatility only for fall and winter a dress up occasions and for the adults not for everybody guys so and then the price is good the tone port but it's cheap this is a New Zealand dollar I will re say it's a $200 so it's cheaper than Chanel and the longevity guys I will just say 10 out of 10 longevity a good sellage um you know um a very good projection it will project for three hours the sellage is so wide I mean maybe 10 to 12 feet it's really good they will really smell you from far away if it is outdoor the wind will carry that sellage far and it's really a good sellage a good amount and the longevity guys is last for eight to ten hours some others say it's just very perfect 12 hours but i would just say eight to ten hours i tested this for a week it really lasts for a good amount of time when you when you rock this on your collar on your shirt or your jacket it will last for another two or three days but on your skin i just simply say eight hours plus very good at perfect 10 out of 10 performance and this how much should I rate this guys I would I have a lot of friends that rate this a 10 out of 10 but for me I have to be in the mood to wear this fragrance should be a winter or fall and it's a moody in my own opinion this is just a 7 out of 10 fragrance that is my conclusion and that's my rating guys I like this fragrance but not love I have many fragrance but I could dumb reach even I'm not thinking but this one I have to be in the mood to wear this tempered noir extreme so that is guys if you don't like this video I welcome you thumbs down I know there are a lot of haters there but you are so welcome and thank you guys for watching but if you like this video and you are new to this channel please subscribe all right guys thank you for watching again this is Patrick T guys saying this is Patrick T saying all the time. It's not how you look. Nah, nah, nah. It's always how you smell. God bless and peace out. Boom.